all right so what's going on guys um so we're back playing missing children again um we last left off uh where we found out the grandma wasn't real and um we just got the dog food from the little girl uh i told you guys i wanted to finish the game um so i'm gonna try and do it today hopefully i'm not too close to the end and hopefully you know the end isn't too much farther along because i don't feel like playing this game you know or making this series into about three parts i just wanted i wanted to finish it in the first part but uh, if you want to be honest it was a little late and i was a little scared so you know i gave up on that but uh hopefully in this one we'll finish it out um <clears throat> but yeah uh, i'll leave the link for part one in the description so you can click on that one and watch that one before you come to this one so you can see where we left off and everything we went through and all that um and before we start man i'm gonna need you guys to like the video um go ahead and comment and then subscribe to the channel it's really really important that you do these three things man because it really lets me know that you know these videos are actually getting out there to y'all and y'all are liking what y'all are seeing if not man let me leave a comment and let me know how y'all feel what you want me to play what you want me to do you know in the upcoming videos and i appreciate that <sighs> all right we are back where we left off um i didn't save the game from last time so i had to run through this whole game again just to get to where i was um it's still scary running through it again so yeah we're gonna have to tell the little girl here um in my last video i went through all this talking yada yada she gives me the dog food we find out grandma ain't real and she makes the creepy noise and i walk outside and i don't feel like checking anything out um yeah so i know we need to go to mizuki's house because the dog in the back is laid down like see hurt something's wrong with it but um i know he's laying down on the ground so i'm gonna give him this dog food and i'm not too sure what happens after this right here yeah, puppy. keep the dog food but where's he go though they don't be feeding their dog they don't cut their grass either as you can see Is he leading me somewhere? Where's he taking? Where's he going? Oh, he dug a hole. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't even get to see what that was. Do you have a head? Did he have a head? Did the dog just have a head? Yo, what? I was and you staring at me makes nothing. You just don't make me feel better at all. Yo, what? Ah, uh, yo. Please be standing here, lady. She's not. Where's she at? This is creepy. Ah, oh, this is mad creepy dog. Late. Uh. Okay, so I'm kind of stumped because. I wish a police officer would help. I know police officers do some type of detective work. They just don't sit around like my man is doing. I need a key for it. I got the dog food from the lady. Maybe I need to go to somebody else's house. That's the only thing because for some reason, every time I go to somebody else's house, you know, it makes everything, uh, something else pops up. Let's go. First of all, let's go to the police station. Because if this game crashes or anything like that, I'm saving. Because I, I will be pissed. There's a random guy out here. I'll talk to him in a second, but I want to save first. No, I want to save, yes. Gracias. 
All right, let's check it out. Hmm. Uh, um. Are you okay? Not really. What happened? I don't know. Just very tired. I'm so tired. I don't even want to look at you. The thing is, I'd forgotten to buy some booze. Stores around here close early, so if you and your police friends want to want me to go away, please bring me a cold one. Thanks. All right. I mean, it really didn't bother me that you were standing out there, but uh, sure. Do they have anything sitting out here, though? It's a back alley. Shit, this out. No, nothing back here. Though you would think they'd put something right back here. Um, hmm. Where will we be able to find some beer? Oh, we'll just look around for a sec, because I want to I keep looking around. This isn't the right way. All right, I'm sorry. Oh, I know, I know, I know. Um, uh, Kane's house? The the guy, the man, the the dad that's standing in there. He's drinking beer. I'm gonna ask if I can get a cold one now. And my man's is just the one that was getting lit in the kitchen. His son's gone. He said he don't have to worry about nobody no more. I need to check him out. Give him a holler. Hey, what's going on, man? Yeah, I need a cold one. Yeah, I need a cold one, dog. First of all, where is his refrigerator at? Alright, cool. Hey. Turn the creepy music off, dude. Where is his refrigerator? Where? Where do you even get this stuff from? What kind of kitchen is this? You have beer in your hand, if I'm not mistaken. So you should give that to me, you know? And I know I'm supposed to be moving furniture or something around, dude. Because the key. What is this? Okay, it's not working. Maybe I'm missing something. Oh, oh! Are you are you kidding me? Yo! Why was he standing in the man? Please. Please come with me in there, man. Please come with me in there, dude. It's too creepy, man. Oh, my God. Please. Jesus, man. No. Nah. Bro is a freaking creep, dude. Shut the door, man. Pull the key out, man. Crap! They were fighting again. They really hate each other and can't. And I can't sleep. Dad was mad about what Mom made for dinner. I thought it tasted good. Again, I'm honestly getting tired. Dad was upset about Mom buying a bag online. Why can't she reward herself once in a while? Mom was the loud one this time. This time around. Dad's been drinking recently and, and is wasting money for God knows what. Then that dad made some excuse about how it's not fun coming back home and how dinner tastes. What is going on? Today's my B-Day and neither of my parents remember it. Not even a single word of celebration. Just fighting as always. I'm getting sick of it. What's sickening is that we, they were angry because of my failing grades. <laughs> excuse me. Although it's been a steady decline, I can still pass. And I'm just below the average. All they want is a reason to fight and complain about each other. Don't they ever get tired of fighting? I feel as if I don't have a home. I start to lock myself up in my room every time one of them comes back. I don't want to hear their voices anymore. Every night I wish my life was a little happier. Just a little fine. Today's fight was something else. I, over I overheard something I shouldn't have. They said they wouldn't be here together if I weren't born. They also said that I was born before they were married. They married. Before they married. Okay. I'm sure that's what they said. How come they never talked to me about it? I feel unwanted. 
like I shouldn't exist. I don't feel right to be in this world. I was born for my parents were married. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. Don't do that. I want to hide the kid. I want to hide... I want to hide the key behind a piece of furniture again, but I hid it inside my pillow this time. Just so I don't forget, I'll write this down. Mizuki said that I should let the dog handle the hiding, but why trust a dog? Because a dog has a freaking head, dog. Hey, shut, shut the door. I don't know if you've met the dog. I don't know. I ain't, I ain't messing with it. I'm sorry. I'm getting out of that house as quick as possible. I was taking a little, it was a little creepy. It was taking a little bit longer to... Alright. Um, let's go to the police station, man. The dude's standing outside. I, I, I'd rather be outside with a bunch of people around me than out there. Okay. Oh, Lord. Hallelujah. You are my hero. Here, please take this. I'm sure this is what you were looking for. Thank you so much. You better go, man. Ain't that boy dipping. I just did y'all's work. Y'all know that, right? This is what y'all supposed to be doing. All right. Um, take me to Kanae's house, because I'm going to go put this in the uh, thing. No. Wrong place. Akiko's. My fault. Alright. Go back here. We're going to put this offering down. <sighs> so I can't get over. One, the dad standing in the corner. Dude, that, that freaked me out. I, nah. I can't deal with that. I was not ready for that at all. Um. There we go. Wants me to offer something. I think I need, let's see. I need four more things? Five? Or just two? Or one? I can't tell. Um, now we need to go in the backyard <laughs> to open up the, the box that the, the head, the, the, it looked like a pumpkin. If you want to be honest, it looked like the dog had a pumpkin on his head and he just ran off. And a man started talking to me. Uh, let's go to the house. Really, really creepy. I think probably the creepiest part of this whole game was, um, he do that only at this place it's only at this place is when he's just staring at you like that it's so creepy but um <laughs> the probably the creepiest thing about this game was the dad for sure by far dad standing in the corner dipping what is this computer password okay whose computer who has a computer? Is it this girl that has the computer? I want to say it is. I think it's this girl that has a computer. Can you look at me? Yeah. He, he, when you get up close to his face, man, he ain't about it. I hate loading into these houses, man. If something pops out at me, I think I have to come through the door. View email. The email says, Mizuki, I heard you broke up with your boyfriend. Are you okay? I remember you would tell me how much you love him. <clears throat> I'm a little worried. I'm not too sure what all that means. Talk to me anytime. I would gladly help you out. View chat. In a strange chat box, it says, Mizuki, don't forget to bring it. Akiko, I know. Kane, that park, right? Akiko, don't be late. Hold on. There's a shadow of something that's not there. Maybe, um, dude knows what they're talking about, and I can go to a park or something. 
as he stands behind me. Where would you like to go? Uh, let's go to the police station first. I want to save. I want to save. I want to save. Look, you know, look creepy at me when you're in front of your boss. What's going on, man? I want to save. You, I wish you were with me. You should have been with me. I don't like this guy. I don't like this guy. He's creepy, bro. He's creepy. I don't like it. He just stares at me. Achievement unlocked. The park. Okay, you can stand in the light. Alright. Let's see how creepy this gets. Are you freaking kidding me, dude? Yo. No, man. No, man. No, man. No, man. God dang it, this is creepy, bro. I got freaking chills. Like, no lie, I have chills. This is creepy. I can't even hear. I got, I, honestly, I have the headphones off my head so I couldn't hear. And it's still freaking creepy, dude. Does she follow everywhere I go? Come here. Man, oh, all right. Yeah. So you'll run, but you won't come. T nah, man. Just, yeah. Keep your distance, dog. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to be, I'm not going to be hard about it. I want you to stay away. Can I get you hooked on something so you can't come near me? She's walking in place. She's deal. Oh man, dang, it's too creepy, I'm scared, my hands are sweating right now, like pouring sweat, Chuck is not cool at all, bro, I can't go up on the creepy bridge, yes, please let me on the creepy bridge, this is exactly where I want to go. Freaking weird, bro. I'm sorry if I just keep saying the same thing, but dude, I'm I'm scared. Stuff is creepy. The creepiest thing is the girl crying. Honestly, yeah, I, I said it was a dad. Nah, it's the girl crying when you're in the house and you start hearing, like you start hearing that, dude. You know it's over. You just know it. And I keep checking behind me because I don't want this girl to just start running up behind me. I don't want to just turn up and just start going crazy linebacker style and just freaking no she's at this end yeah, just run to her just run to her <laughs> I try to be a thug I try to be hard uh uh I do. My toes are crinkled. I like I'm losing the feeling in my freaking hand, but I think it's coming from me. That my thing on a keyboard weird. Oh my god. God, this is so bad. And sprinting does nothing. Don't tell me I have to walk all the way back. That'll be but. I'll throw your shoes. 
crap, bro. What do they want me to do? Oh my gosh, they killed themselves. I have fainted and fell into the pond. Luckily, Funashi rushed over and saved me from drowning. Who is that? I think Funahashi. That might be the police officer. I'm not so sure. I couldn't have saved Takumi. And tonight, I couldn't even save anyone once again. Not even one of them. What am I doing? For an entire week, I locked myself up. And I didn't have the will to do anything. Why would they do such a, such a thing? I knew the reason for their suicide. Resentment filled my heart. When Takumi took his life, I tried my best to look away from reality, but to lose someone so close is just unbearable. I had never thought that this kind of thing could happen so near. Somewhere inside, I wish it was someone else else's affair. The matter was too big not to take it to my own hands. That's why I wanted their help this time. I can't repeat the same thing. I couldn't save them. But I couldn't save them. The emotions I had locked up since the death of Takumi started to well up again. Takumi... Takumi made me who I am today. Oh, this is creepy. Death is sad, but death moves us. I will not be defeated. Now I carry the weight of three more. We cannot allow for their end to be in vain. I just want to hear what music's playing and take it right back off. Never. I will not waste their death. I have to stand up. That is the only option left for me. Nothing else after that. I got the bad ending. There's a difference. There's two. There's two different endings. I can't lie, man. Um. Can I skip this? I don't. Yoshi. All right. You can't even exit out of this, okay. We'll do this then. Well, I'll just let it play. Bump it. Okay, um... I'm kind of confused if you want me to be honest, because I cannot remember the names of everybody. Um, I know it's Kiko, Kane's, and Mizuki's. Those are the three kids that kill themselves. I'm not too sure who Funa, sh Funa, whoever that was. And maybe the other person was her daughter or her or her, her son or something like that. I'm not too sure. Um, and I guess they committed suicide, so that's why she decided to, you know, take up that. But, yeah, um, well, we beat it. Uh, we still had a good bit left. Actually, the best scares were in this part right here. Um, I'm sorry if I was screaming or anything like that, man. It's just horror games. Just horror game. I had to hear. Just horror games really, just really scare me, man. Um. But yeah, that's the end of the game. This game's called Missing Children. Um, I found it on Steam. It you can find it on Steam for like two dollars and something cents, man. It's really cheap. But for that price, I'm gonna be honest. It's one of the better games I've played. I mean, obviously it doesn't look good, but just story wise and everything like that it is really good. Um. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, man, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think of this. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me. Even if it's fake.